Beautiful moving people, welcome back to a new video. Today, yeah, I'll be showing you where I spent the, the past week, 10 days about. This is it, more or less. A very uh, your relaxed and quiet uh, parking spot, which is exactly next to Oh, uh, I, <clears throat> I'm trying to make also friends with this good old doggy because, as far as I understand, she has a broken leg and is very scared. But from the other side, she's like kind of, um, yeah, wants the connection. Let's see. Anyways, so it's the parking spot of. Um, the, the hot springs or the Iamatic baths of uh, Cayafas. Cayafas is a lake which is like back here. Very nice. And yeah, that's supposed to be the bath there. We're gonna be having a look at it later. I actually didn't check it out yet. But yeah. Skilura! Alright, this is the first time she's done it, like, actually come a bit with me on the walk. This has been also the walk I've been doing the past days, except of course yesterday night because it was thunderstorming. Um, yeah, basically a walk around the lake. So I'm going to take you with me now on that. And uh, let's see if uh, she comes with. Ah, the broken bone, the broken leg. So yeah, just to catch up a bit, the storm that was brewing in the past video, it was hefty, uh, like uh, really hefty, like uh, powerful. Wow, I managed to like get the um, like shelter behind in the woods there, and it was good. Also. Uh, the two friends there, the doggies, they they slept underneath the car. It was like, I think, uh, a good uh, choice. Anyways, yeah, for here, I have been sick, as you can hear. <clears throat> hey, she's coming with. Okay. Uh, she's coming with, let's see. Uh, yeah. I have been sick and been laying in bed like for two days. I thought of doing like a video of uh, yeah, how it is when you're sick and <laughs> living this life. Anyways, got my tea now uh, and it's uh, like yeah, coming out and all good. So this is a Prince in, let's say uh, almost nature spot like a lot of uh, yeah let's say wildlife as you can see <laughs> and uh, really quiet now the only thing you can hear is for sure in the back there behind the woods there is like uh, the big street which goes from the north to the south and uh, it basically also divides after it it may not even be whatever like really close whatever uh, <coughs> it's the sea so this is kind of a I don't know let me know in the comments if anybody knows this but I don't know if this is a, like a, an artificial lake because it has a connection to the sea and uh, so with a kind of bridge situation in the back there there is like an abundant 
kind of uh, I don't know situation that also uh, as far as I understand is a part of the baths of uh, Gaiafa but yeah the entry is not allowed let's see maybe we can get inside let's try and go around She doesn't have a name yet. Let's see, maybe we can. She's pretty scared. Uh, I don't want to know what happened to her. Oh. oh, my nose. So maybe this vlog will be about her. But she walked now. Uh, yeah, we went now maybe one and a half kilometers. And she had the, made the sign that she's a bit tired, so we thought we make a break. But she came, this is the, the closer, it hasn't been, I mean, we met like now one week, about seven days, a bit less maybe. And so close, she was never. She kind of wants it, in a way, but I think there is so much... Uh, trust gap that um, yeah she doesn't let it I can understand who knows who's done this with her leg but anyways she's a warrior so we're taking a rest and then if she comes with on the next stretch I'll show you where we were in between Okay, friends, this used to be the crossing to go to the other side, but it's flooded now. Pulluamu, uh, pulluamu. Uh, so we're gonna be heading back and uh, try and show you the spot from the other side. Basically, here in the front, I don't know if you can see it. starts a whole uh, process of like a uh, process it's like a, how do you say a promenade like a pier system or like uh, around the and uh, yeah I think we're gonna be heading back maybe take a rest <coughs> for her to like kind of uh, yeah relax her leg and uh, because she's always on the one and then try and go from the other side and show you the spot okay making a small way because uh, for sure I forgot and did not ah, <laughs> calculate that uh, yeah it rained so the same way we were cut off on the other side we would be here as well good that way you found this rock Blah, blah, blah. So friends, as you see, in the back there, it's the sea. I don't know if you can see the sea, 
but this is a bridge connecting the lake with the sea. Okay. There used to be also a train station here. So as far as I understand, it was a bigger site, let's say like this, for some time. But yeah, no train is running nowadays. So it's closed and no possibility to go inside at least I don't see one if we would have the kayak now or the canoe tag we would set the sail from the other side and then land here anyways I feel the sickness. Uh, sorry, birds. So, what I realized in the past uh, days walking here, uh, there is like a stretch of water in between the island and then the lake. And uh, of course, it's a good refuge for all the uh, birds here. But as far as I understand, in the summer, there is action here, like. Uh, Water sport action. Oh. So, as you see, this is like the kind of uh, pier that um, I told you about before when we were across, which stretches basically all this bit. Then there is the gap, and then here, let's say maybe a fourth, a fifth of the lake. Okay, the walk is done, and this side we cannot move anymore. Oh, I feel a bit more sickly now. Gonna take a sip of the water. <laughs> there is a good fisherman there doing his thing. Ah, the look of the olives. Okay, so let's uh, jump back to camp. Good morning. It's the next day. Uh, yeah, yesterday. Hey! Good morning, good market! Good market! Uh, yeah, yesterday there were some locals inside the spring, so I didn't want to yeah, go and stick the camera in their face. Um, so, we're gonna be having a look at the springs now. And here we are. So I understand this is more or less the natural spring. So it comes out from over here and then flows into the lake and into the sea. And I had a chat yesterday with one of the locals and she said that now it's maybe not the best time to go in due to the, the rainfall of the past days. 
you can see it, she said, the best indicator is if you are here, if you see the water move with a good flow, then, um, then they are amazing, good quality, let's say like this. Now it's a bit murky as you see. By the way, we didn't do the test today. We have the hot springs. Yeah, yeah, uh, uh, uh. it's uh, it's like it's not hot, not even warm. I would say. Okay, well, this used to be a whole bath location. Alright friends, that's it. This will be the end of the video. Thanks for sticking by till this moment. You are the bombs for the support. Um, yeah, maybe we find another uh, hot spring action at one point here in Greece and we can get our uh, bath. <laughs> okay, then uh, yeah. Hope you're doing everything you want to be doing in life and you're doing it good and you're enjoying it. I'm gonna be leaving you now. This is the end from the Kayafas um, baths. And uh, wish you a good one. Don't forget, you know, thumbs up, subscribe, all this stuff. You know this, I hope. <laughs> Give it a go. And uh, see you in the next one. Peace out. Love in. Tschüss.